We present a combined sampling and optimization based planner that can generate motions in challenging terrains for legged wheeled machines. Our use case is motivated by walking excavators which have four legs and an arm. However, the planner could be used with different morphologies as well. The proposed algorithm computes kinematic whole body motions and contact schedule for all limbs. Motions found by our planner are all statically stable. Our planner is divided into two stages, an initialization step based on roadmaps and rapidly exploring random trees, computes contact schedule and a whole body trajectory that roughly satisfies the system's constraints. For example, the initialization step does not enforce non-holonomic rolling constraints, nor does it force the shovel to stay aligned with the terrain. Subsequently, the optimization-based refinement step satisfies all the system constraints, Refining the plan with optimization ensures physical motions. Discovering a feasible contact schedule using trajectory optimization is very difficult, especially for robots that cannot execute full flying phases such as walking excavators. Besides, the terrain constraints are very non-convex and require a good initial guess. In challenging terrain, a naive initial guess such as linear interpolation to the goal point gets stuck in bad minima. Our two-stage algorithm ameliorates this problem. Initializations computed using our RRT planner are much closer to the feasible solution and the optimization does not get stuck. The proposed two-stage planner can deal with challenging terrain features such as steps, gaps and rough terrains. Furthermore, the planner successfully generalizes to combinations of these terrain features. By using the RRT as a backbone, we can discover global paths and navigate around the untraversable terrain. One can prefer shorter paths where legs break contact or longer, purely driving paths by merely tuning the cost function. Our approach's current limitation is the computation time required for trajectory optimization in the presence of long time horizons. Hence, the last motion shown does not fulfill all the system's constraints. The plan shown requires adept use of all the limbs and precise time coordination between them, features that would be hard to discover by solely relying on the trajectory optimization.